I'm going to put a gold ripple in there. I run the danger of causing a pyramid, but I don't want to put a heavy fill in there. There's enough heavy fills in the outlines. So, circle, ripple, let's move in. Circle, thank you. Ripple. Bit big. Okay, highlight that. It's a different gold to the one that goes around it so hopefully that's going to be enough now I'm tapping my down arrow key because that moves it one tenth of a millimeter each time I tap it and that looks about central I've got a dry throat I haven't had a cup of tea in a couple of hours and I'm going to run it through the redraw I'm going to hide the display. I'll hide the hoop. I'll hide the grid. I'm not going to put anything in here. I thought about it and I thought no. That's overkill. And normally, if I'm looking at a design, I will do it very slowly. But just looking for any real obvious um, problem areas. Ugh. And I think that's heavy enough around the outside of the paisley.
and that fill makes a nice change from weave fills and satin Excuse me, I didn't sleep last night. I went to bed and just as I was nodding off, a car drove down our close and most cars have only got four doors. This one sounded as though it had a hundred and they all seemed to be slamming. So that woke me out of my I'm falling asleep and then a crowd of people walk past the house as they use our close as a shortcut and then I was just dozing off again and it was 2.30 and somebody with a very heavy footstep walked past the front of my house because that woke me up properly again and I remember looking at the clock at quarter to six thinking I don't go to sleep soon I may as well get up and then I must have fallen asleep because I woke up at about 11 o'clock and even though I knew I was still tired I thought if I go back to bed I will sleep through until this evening and then I won't sleep tonight so I got up but I'm afraid lack of sleep knocks me out so everything I did today I did it slow motion Yes, I like that string of pearls. That's heavy enough.
and that's it. All it needs now is a test stitch. I hope I've given you some ideas and how you can use different stitches to create texture and contrast and the loose densities, how you can use ripple to create these kind of effects. You weave fills to get a rope effect. The create blocks contour fill and I wish now I'd used this pale yellow somewhere else as well, but it's a bit late now. And of course this, nice and open, which contrasts nicely with this satin band. And that little bit of ripple in the middle. And then the bottom hole stitch around the outside against the radial fill with the tatami fill tool, um, fill choice. I could have used more motifs because I've only used them here and here and there. I'm going to go to bed in about 20 minutes. So I'm going to finish this video here, bring the grid back, bring the hoop back and bring the graphic back. Doesn't want to know. Ah, it's because I'm in player. Stop. And tell that save. One more thing, if you want to save to your USB stick, go to File and tell it Export. And that's the same in Hatch. When you want to save it as a stitch file, you export. So I'm going to export this to work Paisley and there we go right I'll see you all in the next set of videos which I will start tomorrow Monday the 4th of July and I know a lot of you tomorrow will be celebrating Independence Day. So I hope you have a really good Independence Day. So although I shouldn't be congratulating you, should I? I should be slapping your wrists because you chose to leave Great Britain. <laughs> but all is forgiven. Right, night night everybody.